Welcome to ServiceNow IT Operations Management, a video course by Pact Publishing. I am Andy Morris and I will be AJ's voice for this course. AJ Kumar Gugila is the holder of Masters in Computer Applications and is certified in Project Management Professional, PMP, Information Technology and Infrastructure Library, ITIL Expert, Microsoft Certified Professional, Prince2 and ServiceNow Administrator. AJ has 19 years of experience in the IT industry. AJ started working with ServiceNow five years back. He has managed ServiceNow programs, has solutioned, architected and handled end-to-end -end implementations and performed process automation and version migrations. OK, now let's talk about ServiceNow Information Technology Operations Management. ServiceNow Information Technology Operations Management teaches you about different applications and plugins that provide different capabilities to reduce disruption caused to the business. Each component of the ITOM suite has different capabilities that can be tied to each of the individual components and business services. We can predict outages well in advance and hence take proactive measures to avoid them. Now let's take a quick look at what we are going to cover in this video course. Introduction to IT Operations Management in ServiceNow section introduces ServiceNow IT Operations Management, the importance of each of ITEM's components and ITEM's high-level architecture. The second section, Mid-Server Essentials, walks through all the necessary steps to install Mid-Server and configure roles. Next, Configuration Management using ServiceNow Discovery covers the different phases available, the ECCQ and Configuring Discovery the easy way. The Creating and Managing Dependency views focuses on learning the prerequisites, understanding the tables and properties, and learning about how to load and view dependency maps. Further, Cloud Management dives further into using cloud functionalities and capabilities, understanding the various out-of-the-box plugins available. Here our focus will be on configuring Amazon Cloud Services, and we will touch on how other cloud providers can be configured. After that, Automation using ServiceNow Orchestration covers the orchestration prerequisites and capabilities. Learn about orchestration workflows and run through a real example of using Active Directory objects. Next. Exploring Service Mapping, walks through what a business service is, how to set up service mapping, and how to perform service mapping using Discovery. The last section, Monitoring using Event Management, deals with event management architecture, exploring event sources and properties, how to configure alert rules and event transform rules. So what are we waiting for? Let's begin this journey together and I hope you'll enjoy the ride.